Okay, so the opposition stated that uh, our brains are not fully developed enough in order to drink. Um, <coughs> this is this this just further shows the inconsistency of the law. Because if our brain is not developed enough to drink at the age of 18, why would one be able to uh, be able to carry a gun at the age of 18? Um, furthermore, yes, furthermore, just to show some more inconsistency on this law, um, cigarette smoking, it's a, just, just hit 21 now, now you have to be 21 in order to purchase cigarettes, but that's just in California, that's not for every state, it's not a federal thing. Uh, but cigarette smoking alone causes more than 480,000 deaths per year, but you can still purchase that at the age of 18, it's a, uh, it's kind of like um, Uncle Sam, I like to call him the government, wants to pick and choose what they feel is correct, uh, what needs regulation, and not what the people feel. Uh, from 1969 to 1976, some 30 states lowered their drinking, their, pur their purchasing ages to 18. So here we are. As a country, the people are saying, you know what, we can do this. We can drink uh, responsibly. We don't need to have government come in and tell us, you know, you have to be 21 to drink. We're uh, taking a responsibility to to uh, drink to drink responsibly on our own. And here comes, you know, Uncle Sam is hovering over our shoulders saying, no, you guys are, you need government, you need daddy, you know what I'm saying? Um, I want to go to a point where the opposition said uh, that you are able to drink in the military depending on what country you are and uh, the commanding general that is in charge. That just shows even more inconsistency. Why would you have a soldier that's fighting for the country, why would you, like, uh, who thinks that that's a smart idea to have him having his first drink across, across country while he's at war for our country or whatever the case may be. Like that just, it just doesn't make any sense. It would make more sense if you were able to have your first drink, learn how to drink responsibly here in the States uh, than across a uh, country in some other uh, country while you're supposed to be performing your duties. Um, this law also states that some 18-year-olds can drink with their parents, as long as they're, they have parental supervision. But not all of us have parents that are uh, right in the mind. You know, some parents are drunks. I know myself personally, if, if I wasn't, if my uncle or something handed me a drink, he'd be like, don't be a wimp, take the drink. So that can come from peer pressure as well. It's just a bunch of flaws in this law, pretty much. It needs to be rethought, uh, rethought out, and uh, yeah, reconsidered. So um, yeah, some people that don't even have parents. So then, how would that work? You know what I'm saying? So yeah, that's all I got.